Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be um, a little bit different. It is a Ray Dunn haul. However, this haul was completely gifted to me. I don't have any hunt with me footage because I did not shop for these items. Um, and I'll get into that as I show you what I have. So let's just jump right in and see what we've got. So the first item we have here is the black, which if you've watched any of my videos before, you know is my favorite, the black coffee mug. Very exciting. This makes my, well, we'll see when we get into the rest of the bag, but so far this makes my second black mug the one the only mug that i found in person myself was the coach mug so very happy about this and i say that this haul is gifted because my sister who wasn't really familiar with uh, ray dunn at all but you know she has seen me post about it and stuff like that so she was in i believe she said she well let me do that she was in marshall's and um, she saw some of the stuff on the shelf. I was like, oh, okay, well, let me go take a look. So she, like, she looked into it and looked it up to like see who Ray Dunn was, all of that. And so she sent me a picture. And on in this picture, it was like two complete rolls of black mugs. Then it was some other of the mugs, um, you know, some different styles that they had. And I was like, oh, yeah, you know, grab me, you know, one of each of the black ones. So I knew what I was getting before it came. And she sent me the pictures. But what's so funny is between her sending me the picture, she said she sent me the picture and, you know, and went to the bathroom. And by the time she had come out of the bathroom, she said I had responded that, you know, yeah, get it, get it. And she went back over to the shelf and there was literally only one of the certain style of mug left, which I'll show you. And she was able to grab me the black mug I just showed you, another one that's in there. And she grabbed one for herself as well. So she was like, okay. <laughs> she said she thought for a minute, like, was I tripping? Because this shelf was just full when I went to the bathroom. I told her, like, it gets crazy. People are serious. So, And she said she was, like, standing there. She had her phone out. And then she noticed because she was kind of lurking. And she noticed people looking. And then she said another woman walked over there, like, you know, wanting to see what it was. Because she was over there, like, you know, on her phone with the pictures and stuff. So I was like, yes, you drew attention. And they came over and just <laughs> cleaned it out. So... Next thing I have is another black mug. She actually, this one says dad. She actually grabbed this one because around the time she found it, fell around Father's Day as well as um, me and my husband's anniversary. So she grabbed this for him. He's not a coffee drinker. Um, tea once in a while, mainly if he's sick, but he, he uses mugs as just regular cups. So this is perfect for him. And his favorite color is black as well. So this is really cute. This is really nice. Put that there and but yeah i haven't been out um done hunting in mm, at least two weeks maybe a little bit more i've been more focusing on like my plant stuff so i've been like into that going to different nurseries getting stuff together for my plant um channel if you are into plants at all house plants things like that i will um post somewhere here my second YouTube channel, you can go and check it out. It's called Green Thumbish. And I'll just go through, you know, my houseplant collection and acquiring them and doing different things like that. So anyway, that's what I've been focused on. So I haven't been able to go out hunting. And I thought for a while, like, oh, I don't really miss it. It's like out of sight, out of mind. As soon as she messaged me that picture, and it was at one of the stores that I usually go to when I do my rounds. And I had never found, like, all those black mugs and stuff there before. I was like, oh, see? When I stop going, they get all the good stuff. <laughs> so, anyhow, this is the next one. And this is the mom mug. This is the one when she showed me the picture I had told her to grab. Um, I don't have a mug that says mom. And because it's black, that makes it even better. I'm very partial to the black items. I think they really honestly look the best out of the whole collection. They're absolutely my favorite. Now, a little story on the mom mug. The store where she got this from... It's like a small Marshalls. Um, I was even talking to her saying like, they don't really pay much attention to the Ray Dunn stuff there because every other Marshalls or um, TJ Maxx slash HomeGoods I've been in, there's like a separate section for the um, Ray Dunn stuff. But at this particular Marshalls, it's kind of haphazard. It's like around, like you really have to go through the store and see where it may be. Like there's not really a set display. 
So anyhow, they had a mom mug. It was the white black letter one, but it had those chocolates inside. And as I'll show you, because I have one more item in the bag. I don't like the fact that they mark up the mug. Like this mug was $5.99. And aside from that, are you in an area where the black mugs cost more? Because here I have not noticed that all of our mugs are $5.99. I think I saw one mug that was $4.99, but I believe it was on clearance. Um, but I know that some people say that the black mugs in their area are more up to $7.99. So let me know down below if you've experienced that. But anyhow, it had the chocolates in it. And number one, I don't really care for those chocolates. And number two, I don't think they're worth basically doubling the price of the cup because you put those chocolates in there. So anyway, long story short, I didn't get the mom mug because of that. Now I have one and it's even better because it is in black. It's so funny because my sister bought herself a mug and she was like, some of them are so irregular. And I was like, yeah, you know, that's like a part of the whole appeal of them. And she said, no, but like some of them were like really crazy. Like you would be trying to drink coffee and it would be spilling all over the place. So she's really funny, but she, she likes some, you know, a lot of the stuff. She likes the black stuff too. So she works further out. So she'll be able to get to like those stores that are further out. Like they're closer to where she lives and where she works. So she was just like, oh, I'll pop in, you know, see if I'll, I find anything. It's kind of fun looking around. So I think I have converted her and I have a new Dunn buddy. So <laughs> we'll see what good things she's able to find. So lastly, I have this one. I thought it was really cute, which this one says love. And this clearly plays into what I was just talking about because it has this chocolate in here. And we know the mugs usually go for $5.99. This one was $12.99. So basically they doubled the price because they put this chocolate in here. This is that um, Giardelli chocolate. It's not that good. I don't think it's that fancy to do that. But anyway, when I saw this one with the love, I really wanted it. I know they have some. Um, the Valentine's Day ones, I think they say like XO or something. And they're like pink or red inside or something like that. This one is definitely white inside but i like that the love is in like this reddish pink color so i think this one is really cute this is the first white mug that i have where the letters are not black so i'm really excited about this one it's really cute and i mean i guess if you like to give as a gift it is kind of like a cute little setup um personally if you wanted to make something like this i'm the type of person to like diy so if i was to have a ray dunn mug or even any mug um like i would put my own stuff inside you can do it for cheaper like this no <laughs> but like i said nonetheless i love the cup and um i do have like i said this was gifted to me so when i told her the ones that i liked she just grabbed them up and you know it was like happy belated mother's day so i was very excited about that that was really sweet of her to do and I got some really nice things. So that's what I have from this gifted Ray Dunn haul for you today. I've had it for um, a few days, but have you ever had those times where you, you know, you get up, you go to film, and it's just like such a gloomy day. Today was nice and bright and pretty quiet outside, like no lawnmowers or anything too crazy. So I was like, this would be the perfect time. Let me just go ahead film this and then i can start using the items because i don't want to you know wrap rewrap whatever i like unwrapping them for you guys so you can see what i got so let me know what items you've been finding lately um what do you guys think like i've noticed in some of the groups that i'm in on facebook some people feel Mommy. like um. yes i'm almost done that's my daughter <laughs> um some people feel that all the good stuff is gone because of the shelf clearers, you know, the resellers. Um, not to go too much into that, because I talked about that in a previous video. I don't have a problem with resellers. I don't have a problem with reselling in general. And for people who do have a problem with that, let's just remember, reselling only works because you all are buying it. If the stuff was, was listed and nobody was buying it, guess what, it wouldn't work. But because people continue to buy it in spite of talking so much crap about it, that is why it continues to work. But anyway, yes. Okay, let me finish. All right, let me wrap it up because you can see the kids have come out. It's the end of nap time. But anyway, 
So let me know what you think. Do you think all the good stuff is gone? You, are you still finding some of your unicorns? Hold on, please. I'm almost done. Are you still finding some of your in search of items? Let me know in the comments down below, and I will see you in my next video.